Hi, this is Deb Rasmussen, the author of You Still Got It, Girl, the After 50 Fitness Formula for Women. That book's out November of 2015. And as we're approaching the threshold of November of 2015, I get this question a lot during a busy season for a woman any time of year, but it happens a lot at the holidays as well because we're traveling more whether for business, sometimes it's this is our season if you're in retail or even you're behind the scenes in retail or just traveling for family. How do I fit a workout in? Because I hardly have any time at all or I have no space. I'm at my in-laws and I'm in the basement and they need a workout. <laughs> so how do I work that out? So I have great news. Number one, I have two things that you need to keep in mind. Number one, shorter is better for appetite control. If you want to suppress your appetite, you're going to do less, not more exercise. So short, sweet, but a little bit more higher in intensity is going to help you kind of hit it and quit it. You'll be done and nobody will know that you look that good because you exercised already even before they were up. And what you're going to do is not overstimulate your appetite. And if you go too long, even if you go at low intensity, you still have the opportunity to elevate cortisol levels, which tend to elevate your appetite. And there is that compensation effect where we think we deserve it because we exercise. You don't get that same effect if you exercise for short amounts of time. And here's what I'm telling you. A study that came out last year, just before Thanksgiving, actually showed that doing about six minutes worth of work intervals right before dinner like going outside, finding the biggest hill that you can, power up it for a minute, recover back down, power up it again, do that six times, come back inside, brush yourself off so you look refreshed and relaxed, and sit down to dinner. And you will have suppressed your appetite a little bit, taking the edge off so you can sit down and focus with clarity and conscious ability about what do I really want here? what is really worth the taste and the calories or do the three fork roll try a little bit of this and that and get the flavor without having to pay for it later so that's one secret for exercising over the holidays try to get in at least 10 or 20 minutes several times a week but if all you can do on a really busy weekend and you're traveling say you leave on wednesday before thanksgiving you get back on sunday if you don't exercise more than 10 or 20 minutes on any one of those days, but you do that and stay consistent, you'll be right back on track. Probably not have gained a pound and probably eaten a lot less because you did it.